Justices of the Supreme Court, the Constitutional Court and the judges of the High Court convened in Entebbe to attend the 17th Annual Judges Conference under the theme, The Role of the Judiciary in Accelerating the Transformation of Uganda's Economy. As chief guest, President Yori Museveni officially opened the four-day conference that is also being attended by senior officials in the justice, law and order sector. Commenting on the recent wave of murders in the Busoga sub-region, President Museveni urged judges to deter crime. He repeated his earlier proposal that suspects of capital offenses like murder should be detained for at least 180 days before they are granted bail. So there's no danger from terrorism, there's no danger from uh, cattle rustling, banditry, but the problem now is law and order. Simple crime of killings, 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 killings. Give somebody bail within the 180 days. The president accused some lawyers and judicial officers of frustrating investment in the country, thereby slowing down economic development. If you want to contribute to the economy of the country, you must be the alert on the issue of commercial justice. Air Uganda, you remember we had an airline, they grounded it. That it had this, it had this, there was this, there was this. Acting Chief Justice Stephen Kavuma asked judicial officers not to delay trials since that leaves the judiciary with more expenses, which money could have been used to develop other areas. An adjournment of a prisoner's case for a fortnight alone makes it costly for the country because the prisoner needs upkeep. The acting chief justice also asked government to consider increasing the judiciary's budget from 0.6% to 2.5% of the national budget and also recruit more staff for the judiciary. So we will continue to tell you know, whoever uh, is concerned about the plight because like everybody appreciates, if the justice system fails, then there can be no stability. Sohail Mugabe, NTV.